Hello, I'm David, and welcome to my first show. So this is Professionally Random. I've been wanting to do a YouTube show for the longest time, but I never knew what my show should be. Should it be cooking, comic books, TV, travel, just so many ideas. So this is my chance to do it all. So what's going to happen is every week I'm going to upload some of my favorite videos, weird thoughts, and things that I like that week. Uh, we will have some reoccurring segments, and as you can tell, the technology is minimal. It's going to be what I recorded on my my phone. It's going to be using a webcam. It's going to be me rambling a lot like this, and I'm going to edit it all together with Windows Movie Maker and upload it. So uh, let's get the first segment going. You don't know? So this segment is You Don't Know, and pretty much what this is going to be is if there's like a music group, a TV show, a magazine, something that I thought everybody knew about, but turns out they didn't, I'm going to talk about it. And so today I'm going to talk about my new favorite group. They're called American Authors, and what I'm looking at is my phone, because the high-techness of this TV show or this YouTube show is... Very evident, because I'm going to play my music off of the phone. So starting off, I want to play uh, a song that you probably do know, but you just didn't know is this group. So this is called Best Day of My Life. It's been on tons of TV shows and commercials. So here you go. Yeah, it's best day of my life. Now, when I listen to music on a regular basis, it's off Pandora or Google Play Unlimited, and I put it on random. And a couple days ago, I heard a song by American Authors, and it was actually this song right here called Luck. And I really liked it. And I just looked up, I'm like, oh, American Authors, it's a cool name, they sound cool. So a couple days later, there's another song that I liked looked up happened to be them again this happened a couple times that week to the point that i'm like i have to i have to have the cd so i was not disappointed because every track is almost like three songs so you got this right now this uh once again the song slug it's one of my favorites so very mumford and sunsy but then all of a sudden, in the middle of the song, they decide to, to switch it up. And almost all their tracks are like that. So you can listen to the same track over and over again, skip around, because it really is like two or three songs per song. So once again, the group is called American Authors. This CD is Oh What a Life, and you really need to check it out. Uh, and for everything that I'm going to do on this segment, please let me know if I missed my mark, if, if you loved it, if you hated it, uh, because that's really going to depend on what kind of music, I, uh, music and TV shows that I talk about. Uh, I will leave with one last thing, though. The last time I felt this strongly about an album was Fun, which was like a year or two years ago when it first came out. And that one uh, went on to win, I think it was Best New Artist in the Grammys, which is really weird because the time before that that I felt really strongly about an album was uh, The Killers for CD. And that also went on to be like best new artist of the Grammys. So my bold prediction right now is American authors are going to clean up, at, or not the Emmys, the Grammys. The uh, American authors are going to clean up at the Grammys. So uh, we'll see. Um, now what?
So that's my first show. And I would say uh, it was a lot easier than I thought it was, but it is 1.37 in the morning, at, and uh, I think I started at about midnight. So hopefully this will go a lot easier, and definitely it will get better, because how can it not? Uh, but before I end, I do want to say, since this weekend is Mother's Day, happy Mother's Day, especially to my mother, because she is the reason that total strangers that she meets in the store can tell every detail of my life, because she's always so proud of me, and she just tells random strangers stuff about me, and they tell me later if they ever meet me. Uh, also, and I just found this out as I was looking through photos today, uh, growing up, I used to always wear, like, plaid pants, polyester shirts, and I, I grew up in the 90s. I did it because I, I wanted to be my own fashion statement. And I realized as I was looking through photos, I think I got my flair from my mother, and this photo should be able to prove that. So, for everyone, especially my mom, who used to make fun of how I dress sometimes, I got it from you. So, payback is awesome. Uh, thank you again for watching, and next week's is going to be very interesting, because I have a fun event that I'm going to go to, and I will definitely have video. So, remember, leave me some comments, message me, and... Uh, Let's make this show awesome. Thanks again.